Hello, in this presentation, we will be covering the exporting of a balance sheet within QuickBooks Pro 2018 to Excel. If you've been following along with us, we will be continuing with the Get Great Guitars problem. If not, that's okay. We're going to talk about how to export a balance sheet to Excel. If you have the backup file, you can restore it by going to the File and Restore. We also have the open windows open. You can open this by going to the view tab and the open window list. And we have the home page here that can be found at the company and home page. We're first going to open the balance sheet and then work on exporting that to Excel. Selecting the reports drop down up top, going down to company and financial and scrolling down to the balance sheet. Going to then change the date to 123121, December 31st, 2001. That's what we will be working with. We're going to export this to a Excel sheet. This will be the first Excel sheet we will have, uh, the first tab on the Excel sheet that we will have this report. And therefore, we're going to create a new workbook in order to export this information. So we're going to go to the Excel drop down up top and we're going to create a new worksheet. And then within that worksheet, we're going to place a new workbook. So it's going to have both a new workbook. That's going to be the actual Excel workbook. And then it will go to that new worksheet within that workbook. And we're going to just go ahead and export it. And that'll just open up the program automatically and export this information to it on a new tab within it. Here it is. We're going to do our normal customization here. One is that it has the freeze panes here. So I'm going to remove the freeze panes by going to the review or the view tab, the windows group, and then split. So I'm going to unsplit the panes. Then I'm going to change, I'm going to check that the header is the way we want it. So I'm going to go down to the layout view by selecting this item here, the second one, page layout. And you'll see that the header tab is up top and we have the split is gone. So that looks like what we want. We're going to go back to the normal view. And here's going to be that information. I'm going to double click on the name of the tab. Rename the tab to just balance sheet. And then we'll save this. So I'm going to save this item. Go to file and save as browsing. Go into the location we want, which mine is going to be on the desktop. We're too many things and get great guitars. Section two is where we're going to put this. I'm just going to call it section two, two reports and OK, saving that. And there is that. So I'm going to close that up. And there it is. We have saved the balance sheet. We're going to be working on some other reports some other variations of the balance sheet now. And we will then uh, save those to that same Excel document on new tabs.